Watu wako na njia za venye wanaishi maisha yao whether uko msanii ama a normal person who's not a celebrity. If I don't want cameras on my face every time, that is a personal choice. It's not about showbiz ama nini, it's a personal choice. So kwa sababu kuna wasanii wengine wanapenda kamera kwa sura yao kila saa. Si kila mtu anaishi hivyo, unaona? Si kila mtu ako na persona different. So usi usi castigate wasanii wa mimi najua mimi advocate wa wasanii wa Kenya. Ati wasanii wa Kenya hawajui showbiz. It's not about showbiz, bro. It's about how you want to live your life. Now if the way we are living our lives, I'm I'm living my life. It's not interesting to you. Then I'm sure kuna watu wengi sana yani unaweza get content kwa. So usi castigate watu ndo I feel atio kuchini yani it's not good but all in all I like what you guys are doing Butita uh, SPM Buzz yani you guys are doing a great job keep on doing it and god bless you SPM Buzz All right what's up guys this is Buzz with Stars right here on SPM Buzz My name is Miss Kitinchi and look who I just found out at the TSO quite a surprise Calligraph Jones what's up Calligraph I'm not Calligraph today I'm brand Robert Oko Molo oh. I'm here as a fan and not a musician uh -huh. yeah yeah nikopa kama fan siko hapa kama msani yeah ah all right and that's why I was actually just surprised I'm like oh Kali is a, you know a fan okay Ryan is a fan of yeah. you know TSO how do you feel that TSO is back were you a fan of TSO since Kitambo I've always been have a, been a fan since way back and hata nyuma najua mimi sitoke yangi kwa kwa mashughuli mingi sana but if you see me in a place like this then definitely there there there, there is some history behind it I'm a, uh, you guys for those who know najua mimi as I come to a gospel I was doing gospel music when I started out and then along the way things happened but uh, when I see something like this happen again kuna kupata chance ya kuona tu kama wanono wanono family uh, kuona ekodida kuona uh, masimasika kuona who else kuona rafton daddy owen uh, jog c all these guys man say yoni that's a blessing we don't take for granted yeah uh -huh. um, i mean that's very good to hear now you know are you going on set to for pom today na 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 like i said i'm here as a fan siko hapa kama sani niko tu hapa ku support cuz Uh, na feel fit yani kwa zingine unakuja in an environment where you feel like you you, you get blessed so i knew just me being in this place i feel like uh, i'm receiving a lot of blessings uh -huh. and hence me being here today but i'm not here as a musician i'm not performing yeah. yeah i mean we totally believe that because we've seen you um you know bring your mom in studio you know your mom in a video yeah. what's your relationship with your mom when it comes to religion Where is Sasa? You are veering off the point. I see you guys you think you think you're smart, Cindyo. I do never but I mean just off what is off what is shared. It is common knowledge that I'm tight with my family, my mom included. She's always been part of my journey from the beginning. So I mean, yani you know what it is. That's that. Yeah. Would you like to tell us you know why did you decide to stop doing gospel music and decided to do, you know, this other, you know? Iki to ni calling. It's a calling and at that time I didn't feel like I was I was I was ready. I come from a very prayerful background. I've always said that from the beginning and I'm hoping that in time I'm going to hear that uh voice again, God's voice and uh hopefully I get back to doing gospel music, but I've always been a believer and I and I I, I believe in God, yeah. Yeah. I mean Kali, I know I know you have a couple of favorites, you know, gospel songs the back in the days but I would like to know is there one that you remember that you know you used to jump to kabisa uh yeah kuna but then i have a couple i not not even one if this interview is going to be seen by a guy called porcupine porcupine man say big shout out to you you know what you did big shout out to you man say i was hoping i would see you here today but unfortunately porcupine are you ko hapa hivi there is a there's a song by there's a, there's a girl called Nimo ilikuwa inaitwa ilikuwa inaenda yeye ngome ilikuwa inaenda aje but that song i really liked it ilikuwa uh, when the road gets a little bit rough tough and hard ukifikiri ku give up usife usife moyo yeah usife moyo ilikuwa inaitwa usife moyo but i think it was Nimo that was that was my jam up to date yeah so that is that song yeah 
All right, guys, we've been able to see, you know, Calligraph Jones the other side. He said today is here as Brian Omolo, and we totally appreciate that. Thank you for talking to SP Ambassadors always. Eh, hey, na, sasa tani sazile. Silver Kido, this is a message to you. What you are going to do is when you are in the whether you are a normal person who is not a celebrity. If I don't want cameras on my face every time, that is a personal choice. It's not about showbiz or manini. It's a personal choice. So, because of the fact that you are going to have a camera on your face every time, you are going to have a persona different. You are going to have a persona different. So, you are going to castigate the person. I am not an advocate for the person in Kenya. Ati, wasani wa Kenya wajui showbiz. It's not about showbiz, bro. It's about how you want to live your life. Now, if the way we are living our lives, I'm, I'm living my life, it's not interesting to you, then I'm sure kuna watu wengi sana yanu naza get content kwa. So, usi castigate watu, ndo wa feel ati wako chini, yani, it's not good. But all in all, I like what you guys are doing, Butita, uh, SPM Buzz, yani, you guys are doing a great job. Keep on doing it and God bless you. Calligraph Jones, guys. Thank you, Kali, for thank talking you, to us. All right, thank you guys for tuning in to SPM Buzz. My good name is Miss Kitinchi. Until next time, goodbye. SPM Buzz.